Farah here, your favorite dental hygienist. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Please subscribe, like, and comment below. If you have any ideas for future videos or any products you want me to review, I'd be more than happy to look at it. And please do subscribe to my Instagram channel also. Okay, so today we are going to talk about a very frequently asked question. I'm in the elevator or at the work or at parties. People want to know what is the best electric toothbrush. So today we're going to talk about the Oral-B 6500 series Genius and the Diamond Clean by Philip Sonic Care toothbrush. Now, independent studies have shown that electric brushes outperform, outclean, and just about do an amazing job compared to the manual toothbrush. Now, this little guy has been around since the 15th century, believe it or not. It was first invented in China during the Tang Dynasty. And they used um, boar, hogs, hair from the back of their necks, and they used bone or bamboo for the handle. So we've come a long way from there. And fast forward to 1939, and that was when the first electric brush was developed in Switzerland. This is the Philips Sonicare electric toothbrush and I'm just going over showing you what it looks like. It comes with a few different brush heads. The dark blue one is a tongue scraper and behind the toothbrush heads is the travel case. Very convenient for going on vacation or you want to take it to work. And it comes with a very elegant glass jar which is actually the charger. So if you're particular of what's on your countertop, this really is a beautiful toothbrush. This is the Oral-B Genius. It's from their 6500 series. It's one of their top of the line toothbrushes with Bluetooth technology, just like the Sonicare Diamond Clean. And this is the brush. You can see the handle. And here's the base where you charge it up daily. And you have a travel case that comes with it. Very convenient for uh, overnight or vacations. And actually Oral-B has quite a bit of a uh, variety of brush heads to use and one of the best features is this holder it's for your smartphone when you're brushing if you're using the bluetooth technology you can put this right against the mirror and um, see how you're brushing so this is the oral b genius so one of the major differences between these brushes is the brush head so this is the oral b you can see circular compact round and the sonic here looks like a toothbrush and it has a compact head also soft bristles the second difference is the technology they use so the philip uses a sonic technology where these bristles vibrate up to 30,000 cycles per minute and has 62,000 brush movements per minute now, whereas the Oral-B has three technologies it uses, rotating, pulsating, and oscillating, and it moves around 48,800 brush movements per minute. Now, compared to that, the manual moves about uh, 400 to 600 brush movements. Big difference between electric and manual. Now, the other um, really important feature they have is the Bluetooth technology. You need to download an app on your smartphone and it will guide you in real time where you're brushing so it looks like something like this so it will light up as you're brushing where you have gone and any areas that aren't lit up means you still have quite a ways to go so it's really a great technique a way to improve your brushing and to reduce plaque now the second thing they have in common is the travel kits so both of them have these beautiful travel containers for business travel, for vacation, or just going to the cottage. And the third thing they have in common are the multiple accessories. So they have tongue cleaner, soft brush, uh, extra soft brush. Actually, Oral-B came out with my favorite brush heads. It is a pro sensitive. It is very, very good brush head to have. It's actually called Pro Gum Care. One of my favorite brushes. Now, the other thing they have in common are the settings. So I'm going to just turn it on and you'll see all the different settings light up. 
So both of them have about five settings. Now another feature they both have is a two minute timer. So that really helps keep you on track. Because studies show people think they're brushing two minutes, but it's really 30 to 40 seconds. So some kind of time bending is going on there. And another great feature is the sensor. It's a pressure sensor, meaning if you brush too hard, you're an aggressive brusher, you can't let go. The, the electric brushes are great to have. So I'm just gonna show you. So if I turn this on and I press too hard, you see the bottom lights up. So that's the, and the same thing here. And this top will light up and it'll, it'll let you know you're brushing hard. So ease up on the pressure. That's a great feature to have to prevent any gum recession and, and enamel wear. So overall, a lot of things that are similar. So the main difference is the shape of the brush head and the technology they use. So now, how do you decide? The Oral-B Genius or the Sonic Care Diamond Clean? Both great brushes, do a great job, have a five settings, timer, pressure sensor, travel kits, and a lot of accessories, a lot of brush head um, options. Now, one thing where Oral-B edges over the Sonic is this. The Oral-B has a holder for your smartphone. So if you want to use a Bluetooth technology, this is fantastic. You put this over the mirror and you can watch yourself on the app and see how you're brushing. Now, other than that, they're pretty similar. Now, another way you can decide is if you talk to your um, dental professional. They know your mouth really well. They can help you decide if it's the Oral-B or Sonic and what features are super important. If you have a tendency to a lot of buildup, if you have recession, if you have a lot of, say, crowns or bridges or implants, they might say one is better than the other. But for me, I love both of them. They are doing a great job. I really like some of their brush heads. The other thing you might consider is your budget. Is your budget for a Ferrari or for a Ford? So I think it's a good idea to uh, be honest with yourself and also do you want it or need it? But two things that are really important I want you to look at in an electric brush is a two minute timer, that's really good, and the pressure sensor. I find a lot of people nowadays are brushing very hard so that really helps to reduce a lot of issues in the mouth. You will have no regrets. I find I love my brushes. I can't leave even on vacation. Even if it's a day or two, I take it with me. And I f find the people who have purchased them in the clinic, not one person has said they regret buying electric brushes. Now, like I said, you don't need the Ferrari, the high-end models. You can get a lower model, which is just as good, but the features might be less, okay? So you don't need maybe all the five settings. Maybe you just need a two of the settings. Good luck, and let me know in comments if you uh, have liked it or if you've purchased it. And I'll put some links below if you want to buy them. Okay, take care. Bye.